guys, it's Sydney, and this is your 60 minute total body HIIT workout with dumbbells. So grab your dumbbells and let's get to work. Alright guys, so I hope you are ready for this 60 minute workout today. High intensity intervals, we're going to have strength and we're going to have cardio in every circuit. So make sure you have your dumbbells. I have a set of medium dumbbells, eight pounds for me, so grab your options if you would like, or go with the weight that you think would be comfortable for you. All right, we're gonna get started with the warm up here. Let's start with backwards arm swings in two, one, so let's go. All right, let's step it side to side, just add a little side step in there. Tap the feet. Hope you guys are ready for this. We've got four big circuits today. Total body strength. Half of the minute will be a strength move. Half of the minute will be a cardio move. All right, let's switch directions with your arms. Let's go forward. Upper body warmed up. Start with the upper body and move our way down to your core, to your legs, glutes, wrists and ankles. All right, let's cross it over. Bring your knee up through the middle when you cross. Open, cross, open, cross. Good job. Just activate those hip flexors a little bit while we get your shoulders warmed up. Thumbs face the ceiling now. Ooh, there you go. Big open chest. All right. Big wide stance. Arms are out to the side. You're gonna twist, twist. Let's move it down to the torso. Good job. Arms are out straight from your body. to the back of your mat. Let's walk it out, inchworm, down dog, up dog, and then walk it back in. Let's go three more of those. Up dog, down dog, walk it back. Just warming up your hips a little bit. Drop the hips, up dog, shove them back up to the ceiling. Great job. Let's go one more. Drop your hips, chest up, and pull your hips up high. Come on back in, and rest. Let's swing that leg out to the side. Left to right. Again, just getting a little bit of hip action here. Warming up your hips. Lift in one leg at a time, toes are pointed forward. All your weight is back in your heels. All right, now let's take that opposite hand, reach inside, reach inside. Back arm opens up to the ceiling. Again, just a little torso twist. I'm gonna get you nice and warm for this total body workout. There we go. Just about another minute of warm up here. We're almost ready to get started. All right, last one. And good, come on back up to the middle. Step it back to your mat, to the edge of your mat. We're gonna go hamstring, high kicks. Step forward, reach up with the opposite hand. There you go, pull your toe back to your face as you step. Feel it all in the back of your hamstrings. There you go, should be kicking a little higher each time. All right, let's go butt kicks. Get you warmed up a little bit here. Good job. All right, and rest. Okay, so your first move, come on down to your mat with me. We're gonna go 30 seconds of this move followed by 30 seconds of your cardio move, which for this first circuit is just gonna be a sprint, okay? So, first move. Dumbbell is in your right hand. You're gonna do push up and row for 30 seconds, followed by 30 seconds of sprint, okay? Three, two, one, let's go for it. Here you go, push up, row high, push up, row high. Just the right arm on this one. So these first three exercises are gonna be dumbbell in your right hand. Good job. 10 seconds, you're gonna pop up. 
for a, one, or a 30 second sprint. Four, three, two, one, and come on up. 30 second sprint, here we go. Good job, good job. Next move, your second move. When we're ready, in 20 seconds, you're gonna pop down on the floor, left arm down for a side plank, dumbbell is in your right hand. All right, come on down. In seven, six, five, three, two, one. All right, here we go. Tap and tap. Dumbbell is up in your right hand. Side plank, hip tap. <coughs> Excuse me. 15 seconds, and you back up for that sprint. There you go. Four, three, two, one, and come on up. We're sprinting out, let's go. All right, so your next two moves are gonna be the exact opposite of that. Dumbbell is in your left hand. We're gonna go back to the push-up row and then back to the side plank. Dumbbell in your left hand. All right, here we go. In eight, seven, six. Grab that dumbbell with your left hand. Three, two, one, let's go. Push up and row. Need to modify, drop down to your knees for the push up, come back up for the row. Here we go. Nice tight abs. 10 seconds here. That's it. Two, one, and rest. High knees, sprint. Come on up. So after this, Back to the side plank. Left elbow has the dumb, or left arm has the dumbbell. Right elbow is down. Great job, great job. Pick it up a little bit more. You've got 10, nine, four, three. Grab your dumbbell, left hand, right side plank, and let's go. Tap and reach. Here we go. Good job. 10 seconds. You're coming up for a sprint again. Great job. Three, two, one. Come on up. Let's go. Ooh, here we go. Good job. I want you to keep the intensity in your cardio. You've got time to recover in between in your strength moves. All right, they're a little slower, a little more complicated, a little more heavy, or a little heavier. Four, three, two, one. All right, two new moves. Dumbbell is in the right hand. You're gonna go reverse lunge, high knee drive. Right knee's driving, right arm is pressing. 30 seconds right here. And then we're gonna sprint for 30. And then we'll come back and switch sides. <sighs> left arm will have the dumbbell and left leg will be driving. Three, two, one. All right, drop it down. We're back to the sprints. <coughs> Excuse me. <sighs> Good work. Great job, guys. All right, 10 seconds. We're gonna switch sides. So left arm grabs the dumbbell. In four, three, two, one. Left arm dumbbell, left leg goes back and drives. Breathe, breathe, breathe. Already out of breath, right? Me too. 
10 seconds. Core is tight. Keep your focus. Two, one. Great job, high knees. Whew. And we're gonna run through all of those one more time. So back to the plank or the push-ups with a row last time through. Great job. Work it around if you need to. Front to back. Woo After the circuit, we finish one more round of each exercise. We'll have a new cardio move. All right, come on down. Right arm has the dumbbell. We're back to push-ups. Last round. Push-up and row. Let's go. Tight abs. Like I said, if you need to drop the knees, push up, row on your toes. <clears throat> nice work. Come on. Five seconds. Whew. Three, two, one. Come on back up. High knees. Sprint it out. Good job. Strength and cardio all day today. Okay, we'll have a new format for your next round. So don't worry, you won't be bored. <laughs> Gotta keep switching it up, keeping you excited. Whew. All right, eight seconds. We're gonna drop down plank position. Dumbbell in the right hand. Three, two, one, come on down. Here we go. <laughs> Tap and raise. Dumbbell is in the right hand. There you go. Breathe, tap, squeeze your obliques from the bottom of your hip. Good job. 10, nine, seven, six, five, four, three, two, rest. Come on up. Whew. High knees spread again. I'm gonna keep you guys moving. Whew. <coughs> Excuse me. I told you guys, allergy season is in full effect right now in North Carolina, as you can hear. All right, 10 seconds. We're gonna go right side lunge. Let's get all the right side of your body done. Here we go, grab your dumbbell with your right hand, kicking your right leg back. Let's go. Lunge, drive. That's it. Dumbbell moves with the same side leg. You press as your knee drives. Digging that left foot down into the ground. All the power in your left glute. That's it. Four, three, two, one. Let's go, sprint it out. Whew. That's it. We're gonna have all new cardio next round. Up and back if you need to. Little side to side. Whew. All right, so this round, last three, you're going dumbbell in the right or the left hand the whole time. All right, five seconds, grab your dumbbell. Left arm push up and row. Here we go, two, one, let's do it. Last round here. Row. In, down, row. Squeeze your chest on the way up. That's it. Here we go. 10 seconds left here. We got it. Three, two, one. Come on up. High knee sprint. All right, so next we've got left arm dumbbell side plank. Okay, finish out this left side, then we'll get some rest. <coughs> Good job, let's work for it, come on. Whew. You got this today. You're getting strong and you're getting leaner too, right? Five seconds, come down to that right elbow. In three, two, one, side plank, let's go. Up and down. That's it. with me here. 10 seconds. 
And you're going for a sprint. Seven, six, five, three, two, one. Come on up, high knees. Let's do it. We're gonna go for that last lunge and press with the left arm holding your dumbbell and then you get a break, okay? Then we'll switch it all up. Good work, 10, nine. Get ready to grab the dumbbell with your left hand. Ready, four, three, left hand, let's go. 30 seconds here, 30 seconds cardio, and then we, or 30 seconds, yeah. Here, cardio, rest. Whew. That's it. Come on, 10 seconds. Drive, press and drive. We've got this, here we go. Three, two, one, cardio. Finish strong, right here. Whew. Good job. We're almost there. 20 seconds, and then we're gonna grab some water. You guys have earned this rest coming up. Whew. 10 seconds. All right, speed it up a little bit for eight, seven, four, three, two, one, and rest. Whew. Grab some water. You've got 30 seconds rest. A well deserved 30 seconds rest. So these strength and conditioning or hit cardio with strength workouts are tough. It's very important to remember how to breathe. All right. First move of your next circuit. We're gonna go 40 seconds of work here. Grab both dumbbells, you're gonna stack them on the right side. And we're squatting in two, one, let's go. Both dumbbells are on your right shoulder. Squatting and standing. 40 seconds of work here. We'll slow this one down a little. That means if you have a heavy dumbbell option, we're going a little slower so you can step it up if you're ready, which I'm pretty sure you are. There you go. 10 seconds here. That's it. Four, three, two, one. 20 seconds rest, we're gonna go jumping jacks. Here we go. After these jumping jacks, grab your dumbbell, same exact exercise. Right arm, stacked, squat. And then we're done with the squats for your right arm. Three, two, one, grab both dumbbells. Right arm, stacked, squat, let's go. Set your hips back, squeeze them forward with your glutes, okay? Keep your abs tight at the bottom. We don't want your back arching. We don't want it rounding out. Also don't want your knees passing your toe. Okay, so if you can, set your hips back a little bit more. 15 seconds, and we're back to jumping jacks. That's it. Seven, six, five, three, two, one. Drop your dumbbells. Jumping jacks, here we go. Whew. I know you guys are breathing heavy. I'm right there with you. This is what the strength and conditioning workouts are like. You're getting strong and you're chiseling everything out by mixing cardio in between. Come on down to your mat. Dumbbell is in your right hand, right leg is up. We're going toe touches. Right here. 40 seconds of work, remember? 20 seconds cardio. Cardio for the circuit. Jumping jacks, right? You're doing great. Reach for that toe. Don't swing your dumbbell back over your head. Keep it right at your chest. Four, three, coming up for jumping jacks in two. One, let's go. <clears throat> Jumping jacks. And then we're back to the right arm toe touches. Right arm, right leg. 
You're doing great. Seven, six, five. All right, grab your dumbbell. Three, two, one. Right leg up and crunch, crunch, crunch. Pull that lower belly down to the mat. Leave your dumbbell right where it is, over your chest. Good work. Breathe, I'm right here with you. 15 seconds. That's it, seven, four, three, two, last one, and jumping jacks, here we go. That was a burner, right? <laughs> this next one, you're gonna grab your dumbbell again with the right arm. In five seconds, watch me. We've got a glute kickback. All right, kickback and tap. So your right leg is going. Come with me. It's kind of like a half Romanian deadlift here. Squeezing high. Your dumbbell is staying just about right in front of your knee. And I want that kickback to have a big squeeze at the top. Core is tight. Both hips are pointed towards the ground. You've got 15 seconds. Squeeze, squeeze. That's it. Two, one. We're back to jumping jacks. Here we go. Keep it going with me, guys. Feeling stronger, feeling more in control of your body, right? It's not as fast moving, but it's a different way to work your body. Okay, we're going back to the same exercise. Three, two, one. Right leg goes up, right hand has the dumbbell. You squeeze, tap, squeeze, tap. That's it. Find a spot on the floor, stare at it. The harder you squeeze that glute, the more you get out of this movement. Dig the left heel into the ground, squeeze down. Come on, 15 seconds. And then we're gonna move to the left side of the body. Same movements, but we're working on the other side. In four, three, two, jumping jacks, let's go. Whew. Good work. So it just breaks up the strength moves a little bit here. So after this one, you're going back to left side stacked squats, okay? Both dumbbells in the left hand. In four, three, two, one, left side, squat, let's go. 40 seconds right here. Notice my chest is up. This other arm is facing out to the side. Okay, just so you can make sure that your shoulders are straight and your spine is straight vertically. Okay, not arching to one side or the other. It's nice and straight. 15 seconds. Squeeze your quads as you come up. There you go. Five seconds, we're going back to jumping jacks. Two, one, drop it down. Jumping jack cardio, here we go. And feel free in this 20 seconds of cardio to mix it up. If you wanna go high knees here, you can. If you wanna go burpees, you can. I'm sure you don't wanna do that. Three, two, one, one more round with the left side squat. Let's do it. Last 40 seconds of left side squat right here. Good job. Last 20 seconds. Breathe. That's it. 10 seconds, down, exhale, down, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and we're back to jumping jacks. Let's do it. Good job. 
10 seconds, we're going to the left side, toe touches. Okay, so dumbbells in your left hand, touching your left toe. In three, two, one, let's do it. Left leg up, crunch. I'm gonna let you guys feel it out here. I'm gonna breathe, you breathe. That's it, 15 seconds here. You're coming up for jumping jacks or cardio of your choice. Five, four, three, two, come on up, let's go. Cardio, I'm gonna stick with jumping jacks. If you're sick with me, we're rocking jumping jacks again. If you're going on your own, do some high knees, do some side shuffle, anything you want. Do some dancing, <laughs> just stay moving. Three, two, one. Last set of left side toe touches. Let's go right into it. That's it, come on. Reach higher, get closer to that ankle bone. Let's do it, come on, 20 seconds. We got this. Last eight, seven. That's it. Four, three, give me one more. And rest, come on up. Jumping jacks, let's do it. 20 seconds of cardio right here. You're doing great. This is the time where you can reconnect mentally. Keep talking yourself through. Say, I got this. This is tough, but I'm doing it, right? Three, two, one. Left hand dumbbell, left leg, kick back, tap, kick back, tap. Stay centered right in your belly button. Okay, find that spot on the floor where you look at it, tap down, squeeze, tap down, squeeze. That's it. Squeeze, lift, tap, lift, tap. Great job. Good work. Seven seconds. We're going for 20 seconds cardio. And rest. Here we go. Actually, no rest. Just cardio. We'll go one more time with those glute kickbacks. And then you'll get a breather. Let's go. Up, down, up, down. Seven seconds. Three, two, one. Grab your dumbbell. Left arm. Left leg goes up. Tap. Squeeze. Tap. Think about your right side glute right now. It's balancing everything. So dig that heel into the floor. Squeeze it tight. Tight abs. Stay balanced. Here we go. 15 seconds. Hold tight. Almost. Eight. Seven. That's it. Bit of jumping jacks. Here we go. Up, down, up, down. That's it. Ten seconds. In three, two, one. Great work. You've got another 30 second rest right here. Woo. Yes, I'm right there with you. I feel it. seconds. You're going to grab one dumbbell with your right arm. We're going to start with curtsy lunge and side kick. Okay? Right leg is moving, right arm is holding the dumbbell. 30 seconds here. Two, one, let's go. Down, kick. Down, kick. So as you can see, left leg is doing all the stabilizing. Down, kick, curtsy lunge your back and diagonal. That's it. Ten more seconds. 
here we go. Kick, curtsy. Kick and curtsy. Your cardio in this one is gonna be high knees with a tap, okay? Go ahead and rest. You're gonna tap that heel. Tap, tap. All right, when you come back in 10 seconds, dumbbell is in the other hand, and you're gonna do the same thing. Curtsy lunge and kick. In three, two, one. Left hand, left leg is swinging and kicking. Curtsy, kick, whoop. <laughs> kick, swing it right back down. If you need to modify, stop here. Curtsy, stop here. Just stop in the middle, okay? 20 seconds, here we go. Ten seconds, kick and back, kick and back. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. We're back to the heel taps. Here we go. Tap, tap. We're gonna go one more time through that one. I told you every round I'm gonna switch up the format. So we're gonna go one more time through each of those, starting with your right hand and right leg. Here we go. Two, one, let's do it. Opposite side and kick. I like to hold on to my left hip so I can feel my core staying tight as I lunge and kick because there's a pretty good transfer of weight. It's this side and then it's that way, right? 20 seconds, so keep your hand on your hip if you need a little help balancing. 15, kick and down, great job. Eight, seven, whoop. five, four, three, two. All right, let's go back. High knee, heel, heel. Mentally, reconnect again, remember? This 20 seconds is for you to tell yourself, I'm okay, I've got it. This is tough, but I'm here, I'm doing it, and I'm gonna finish. Three seconds, dumbbells in your left hand. Let's move that left leg back, here we go. Breathe with me, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. That's it. 20 seconds left. Keep that right leg dug into the ground. You've got 10, 9, 8, 7, 4, 3, last one. All right, we're back to the cardio. Good news, you're done with curtsy lunges. We're gonna switch up to the triceps next. This will be a good break. Slow your heart rate down. Get a little more focus on the muscle. Okay, seven seconds, I'm gonna show you what's happening. Right arm first, overhead. Right leg is off the ground. You're gonna bend and straighten, all right? Come with me, ready? Let's go. From the front, you're balancing. Right elbow stays close to your right ear. Bend, push, bend and push. 20 seconds right here. Then we're going back to your heel taps. Whoop. Think about your belly button. Everything is centered right into your belly button. Eight seconds. Four, three, two, one. Heel taps. Let's go. Come just a little slower, right? So if you can go a little heavier on that one, push yourself to do that. The triceps are the biggest part of your upper arm muscle development and the tone and the definition that you want to see. Three, two, left arm, left foot off the ground. Here we go. So what I was saying, the triceps, this back part of your arm, there's three muscles in those triceps. So they make up the majority of what that upper arm definition and tone is. A lot of times people do bicep curls all day to try to get some good definition in their arms up top. I challenge you to switch that to your triceps 
and your shoulders. Okay, that's where the majority of the muscle is in your upper arm. Seven seconds. Three, two, one, heel taps. Go tap, tap. So we're going one more time through that. Right arm first and then left arm. And then we're gonna hit some abs, of course. Good job. Four, three. All right, right arm, let's go. Grab the dumbbell, bend, and push. Right leg is up off the ground. Let's go. Focus, bend, push. Bend, push. A little more of a challenge, bring that knee up to your hip height. Bend and push. Bend and push. 15 seconds, here we go. Down, up, down, up. 10 seconds. Woo. Seven, six, keep it tight for four, three, two, one. All right, heel taps. Turn that heel into your body, into your body. We're back with the left arm for your last one to tricep kickbacks. And then we're gonna go, go into some abs, jackknives. Okay, grab it with your left arm. Left leg is up, two, one, let's go. Bicep stays right beside your ear. You feel that stretch here and squeeze at the top. And squeeze. Keep your knee right in front of your belly button. Okay, if it deters out here, it's gonna be a lot harder to hold your balance. Keep it in towards the center of your body. Bend and push. Bend, push. Keep a tight core. Nine seconds. Bend, push, bend. Three, two, one. Cardio, let's go. Like I said, 20 seconds of cardio. You can hit whatever type of cardio you want as long as you stay moving. I'm giving you this option, but if you prefer something else, high knees, burpees, side shuffle, running in place, that's totally fine. Just keep it moving. Grab one dumbbell, come on down. We're gonna go right leg, jackknives. Here we go, up and down, up, down. Just your right leg. Breathe out on the way up. That's it. Keep working with me. 10 seconds. Pull it down. Pull and reach. Four, three, last one. And come on up. Heel taps. Go tap, 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 tap. Let's have fun with it. Woo. Give me a woo if you're there. Woo! I tell you, it gives me more energy. Here we go, down in five seconds. Jack knives, left leg only. In two, one, let's go. Left, then down. Left, down. I want your shoulder blades all the way up off the floor. So bring your upper body up first, and then your leg. That's it. Pull it down. We've got this. 15 seconds, let's go. Up, down, up, down. Seven, six, five, three, two, one. Come on up for those heel taps. Woo. Let's do it. Tap, tap. Speed it up if you can. We're going one more time through each of those. Right leg and then left leg, and then we get a break. Woo. Thank you guys for sticking in here with me. It keeps me going. Three, two, right leg only. Let's go. Last round through these two. Down, up, down. Feel your abs pulling in tight. Fifteen seconds, guys. We got this. Let's go. Whew. 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 
five, four, one more, and come on up. Heel tabs. Whew. Let's go, guys. Left side jackknives, and then we're gonna take a rest for one minute before we head into this very last circuit. Okay, four, three, two, one. Left side jackknives. Let's do it. Down, up, down. That's it, pull your belly down. Keep rocking with me. You are here for a reason today because you don't wanna stay where you are. You have goals, you have ambition and determination to get better than where you're at right now. Whatever that looks like for you, it's different for everyone. Five, four, three, come on up. Last 20 of heel taps. Tap, tap, and then you're gonna go for one minute rest. Good work. 10, nine, five, four, three, two, one, rest. Great job. You've got one minute rest here. Longest rest of your day. Grab some water, grab a towel. We've got one more circuit. You're doing great, guys. I wanna give you a longer rest here because I really want you to crush this last round. I'm with you. I know how tough this is, but I also know that you can do it. You have someone here holding you accountable that cares that you finish this workout. That's what keeps me going here today is knowing that you are there finishing the workout so I can do this too, all right? Keep telling yourself, yes, I can. Yes, I can, okay? Fastest minute ever. We're gonna go ahead and get started. You're gonna go single leg squat. Okay, so let's toss that right leg onto your left leg. Dumbbells at your chest. Squat, stand. Okay, two, one, let's go. Down, up, down, up. Good focus. If you need to modify, take that right toe, tap it down in front, but I want the majority of the work done on the left leg, okay? So wherever your right leg needs to be for you to finish this one, to stay balanced, keep it there, and just keep going with me. Like I always tell you guys, modify if you need to, but figure out a way to make it work, okay? Two, one, drop that dumbbell down. We're gonna go lateral, quick feet, jump, Quick, 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 quick. Jump. Jump, good. Up next, you're going with the right leg down. Left leg is crossed over. Three, two, one. All right, let's cross the left leg. Sit and stand. Find your balance. There you go. Sit and stand. Fight to keep that dumbbell right over your right hip. Your hip is going back, squeezing forward from the side. Sit and stand. Sit, stand, great job. That's it, four, three, two, one. All right, let's go back. Quick feet and jump, quick, quick, quick. Up, quick, 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 up. One more time through those two, up. So we're crossing right leg over left in four, three, two, one, let's go. Right leg over the left. Sit and stand. Find a spot right out in front of your legs. This is hard for me too. I'm always challenging myself. We always say, to get better, you have to do something that you haven't done before. These are not something that I'm good at, not something that comes easy to me. So I'm here pushing myself. You're doing the same. We're getting better together. 
Seven seconds. Hold that belly tight. Two, one. All right. Quick feet side to side. Jump at the edge. That's it. Up. Down, down, down. Seven seconds. Feeling back. Left leg on top of the right. In three, two, one. Let's do it. Here we go. Focus. Pull your abs in. Sit your hips back. Pull them forward. Sit them back. Pull them forward. That's it. Focus. Good. This is how you get better at balancing on one leg at a time. How we get better at those pistol squats that we did a couple days ago. Just focusing on getting stronger, balancing better, using your core to hold everything together. Rest. All right. Whew. So, done with those. Next up, you're moving on. Right arm only. Keep going, I'm gonna show you the move. So you can grab your dumbbell in eight seconds and get started with me. Bicep curl, lateral raise. Bicep curl, lateral raise. Join me in two, one, right arm. Let's go. Curl and raise. Curl and raise. And raise. That's it. Bicep, shoulder. Good job. We've got 20 seconds here. Bicep curl, lateral raise. And then we're going back to the quick feet. Side to side, okay? 10 seconds, squeeze and lift. Eight, seven, six, three, two, one. Quick feet, side to side, go. Quick, 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 jump. Quick, 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 jump. Next time you grab your dumbbell, it's gonna be with the left hand, left arm curl and raise. Okay, eight seconds, five, Four, three, two, grab your dumbbell, let's go. Curl and raise. Keep the shoulder back, especially on your bicep curl. Shoulder is back, shoulder is lifted on the lateral raise. Curl and lift, you're doing great. Yes, we got this. Like I said, keep telling yourself, Yes, I can. I'm okay. I've got this. It's tough, but you're already almost done. So might as well finish as tough and as hard as this workout is. Two, one, you're almost done. So we're not gonna stop now. Up, quick, 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 up. Arms and legs, up. We're going one more time through that, starting with your right arm. Five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Let's go. Right arm. Curl and lift. We've got this, guys. We are so close to being totally done. Think of the moves today that you did that you thought were challenging, right? There's a lot of new moves in here, a lot of combination moves, right? A lot of moves that combine a couple different movements or a couple different body parts. 10 seconds. That's it, three, two, one, quick feet and jump, let's go. Keep it up, keep it up. We're nearing the end of the workout. This is when your mind probably tells you, oh, you're tired, take it easy, we're almost done. Not today, all right? You are here to give me all you've got. Left hand grabs the dumbbell in two, one, let's go. You went so hard in this workout. You're not slowing down yet. Bicep curl, release, lift, release. That's it, here we go. Keep it up, keep it up, 20 seconds. That's it. 10 seconds. Just breathe and work. And 
lift. Four, three, two, one. Quick feet. Let's go. Quick, quick, quick. Don't stop. Don't think about it. Don't go get water and towel off and slow down. We're almost there. All I need you to think is let's go hard. Okay? Seven seconds. Then you're going to come on down to the mat in a plank position. Right leg comes up to your right hand. Two, one. Let's go. Crunch and reach. Crunch, reach. Crunch into the right side, reaching over the left foot. Crunch, reach over. Crunch, reach over. That's it. Sweat is starting to pour, right? 13 seconds. We're coming up for those quick feet. Let's go. Eight, seven, Four, three, two, one. Quick feet, let's go. Up. And up. Great job. 10 seconds. You're going to do the same thing with the left leg. Four, three, two, come on down. All right. Left leg. Crunch, reach over. 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 Reach. Over. Crunch. Reach. This is hard, I know. I'm right here with you. We've got 15 seconds. Crunch. Over. Crunch. Over. Crunch. Great job. Up. 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 These last two rounds, you're gonna do the same thing, only you're gonna go down onto your forearms. Okay, come on down. Last two rounds. Two, one, let's go. Crunch, reach. Crunch, reach. This is tough, I know. I'm right here with you. And crunch, reach, crunch. Seven, six, five, four, three, two. Come on up for those quick feet. Here we go. Up. Seven, six, four, three, big deep breath. Last round on the left side. Two, one, let's go. We got this. Okay, left knee, reach it back. That's it. I know this is tough. I'm right here with you. We've got 15 seconds, all right? You and me, let's finish strong. Five, four, three, two, one. Quick feet, let's go. And up, up at each end, almost forgot. 10 seconds. seconds rest. Grab some water. We're going to finish it out with some high intensity cardio intervals, okay? All right. So, last two minutes, you're going 10 seconds of work, 10 seconds rest. This is all out, okay? Five seconds, high knees. Two, one, 10 seconds at a time. That means you go crazy. <sighs> 10 
seconds. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Walk it out. Side to side. Five seconds. You're gonna go again. Even harder this time. Two, one. Let's go. That's it. Go, 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 go. Five, four, three, two, one. Rest. Good job. Walk it out. Walk it out. Three, two, one. Let's go. Sprint intervals, guys. We've got this. Come on. Five, four, three, two, one. Walk it out. Okay. We can do this. We've got this. We've got one minute left. Let's see how hard we can go. Two, one. Let's go. Arms move quick. Go, go, go. Front to back. Two, one. Rest. Okay. Keep walking. Keep walking. Two more rounds of that. Turn it up a little more. Two, one. Let's go. This is it. Seven, six, three, two, one. Rest. Okay. Ten seconds. And then you've got your very last cardio burst. Five seconds, get it in your mind. You're going 100% effort in two, in one. Let's go. 10 seconds, eight, seven, six, five. Go faster, three, two, one, and rest. Woo. Oh my gosh, you guys, we finished our 60 minute high intensity interval training total body strength workout. Oh, give yourself a minute. <laughs> or maybe that's just me. Maybe I just need a minute. <sighs> okay. Oh, first of all, you have to be beyond proud of yourself for crushing this workout. Give me a big wide stance. Let's just breathe for a second, okay? Give me a big inhale. And exhale. Inhale. Good. Two more. Inhale on your next exhale. You're going to reach up over the sky with your right arm. Hand on your left hip and relax your spine. Guys, that is a workout to be proud of. Whew. I am so motivated by the fact that you guys come here, you show up, you give me all you got, and then you care enough to check in and tell me I crushed it. Switch arms. Those things are what motivate me to keep this going for you guys every day. I love it. I wake up and I read all the comments. I comment back to you and tell you how thankful I am because I genuinely am thankful that I can know every time I do a workout, I'm gonna have people doing this workout with me in this community all over the world, all ages, all genders, all fitness levels. Come back to the middle, exhale, and reach down to the floor. That is what motivates me, this community, this tribe of people who come here, show up every day, check in, tell me what they loved about it, tell me what was super tough for them, and tell me their progress of getting closer to my goals. I made this happen with my kids in the room. I was tired, but I came and did it anyways. That's what motivates me. All right, come on up, grab onto your right leg, pull your heel to your glute. Remember, every time you come to these workouts, <clears throat> excuse me, remember what motivates you, why you're here, why you showed up today, why you care about your body, about your health, about your lifestyle, what is really driving you in your heart, in your mind. And switch sides and use that to push you through the tough workouts like this. So when you get, you know, 40 minutes in through a 60 minute workout, what do you think about that gets you through those last 20 minutes? All right, always keep that in the forefront of your mind throughout your whole day, after your workout, throughout the day leading up to your workout, when you're eating, when you're hydrating, when you're about to go to sleep, keep your why at the forefront of your mind, okay? And this will become a lifestyle, naturally. All right, let's bend one leg at a time. Stretch those inner thighs out. And reach forward, 
back leg forward. Stretch the hip flexors out. Give me a couple more. And just reflect on how proud of yourself you are right now. As the clock rolls down to zero, you have finished this 60 minute workout and I am so proud of you. I cannot wait to see you back here tomorrow, but as for now, be proud of yourself. This was tough. Think back on the workout. Could you have increased your weights on the dumbbells? If there's room for you to challenge yourself even more, take that challenge. And above all, just always go for that challenge, okay? Challenge yourself, challenge your mind. If you think you can't do it, challenge yourself to do it anyways, okay? I'm here for you and these workouts are tough for me as well, okay? So, thank you guys again so much for being here. Like I said, I always genuinely appreciate it. And make sure before you leave to check in, type I crushed it in the comments. Find someone else's comment who said they crushed it, tell them they did a great job. And I can't wait to hear what you thought was the hardest move, was the most fun move, and that you'll be back tomorrow. So make sure you subscribe. Like I said, click the link in the bio if you need another set of dumbbells, maybe a heavier set and click the like button if you like this workout. Cannot wait to see you guys tomorrow. Have an awesome day.